Hello and welcome. In today's episode, I'm going to take you behind the scenes and show you one of my favorite wraps. It's really easy. All you're going to need is a little cheesecloth and we're going to get you rolling on your wrap. You can also use jersey material. It also works totally great. Really anything that's stretchy. This is just one very simple, very easy wrap that you're going to want to add to your repertoire for successful sessions. Hello and welcome. If we have not met, I'm Lisa from Milk and Honey Photography and the Milky Way, and I empower, inspire, and educate photographers just like you to have confidence in their posing, their lighting, and their editing, and to create the business and art of their dreams. So in today's episode, I want to take you behind the scenes. I'm going to show you one of my favorite, very, very simple wraps, and you're going to be able to nail it after this. So let's head on down, and I'll show you how to do it. So what you're going to do is you're going to take almost the entire wrap, about 12 inches to the side, place baby, pulling it just under baby's bottom and crisscrossing baby's legs. I like to place the hands up together right by the face because then it makes it easier to adjust them after. I'm taking this shorter side and pulling it nice and tight around and under baby's shoulder. Making sure baby's booty is nice and tight up, I grab the bottom and then pull the other side over, keeping it very taut so it's able to easily go around baby. I like to spread it out to make sure that I'm keeping baby supported the entire time and then spread it out to make it look pretty, folding underneath baby's bottom and around the other side. If you have a longer length, you can leave it longer. I tend to tuck mine behind baby. So this would be a great base if you were going to be doing a potato sack pose, or if you wanna just leave this pose or even add another wrap. It's very, very versatile. Awesome, I know you can totally do that, right? All you need to do is get a doll and some stretchy wrap. It could be jersey knit, it could be really any other stretchy fabric, or it can be cheesecloth. The purpose is, is making sure that it's about 60 inches and about, say, 12 to 15 inches wide and get started practicing wrapping. I know that you can do it. Thank you so much for watching today. I'm Lisa from Milk and Honey Photography and the Milky Way. And if you have not already subscribed to our channel, please make sure you do. Share with a friend. If you have a photographer friend that would love this information too, make sure you share it along too. And if you have not already, make sure you download the free posing guide so you can have all the names of all the poses on hand with you for your next session. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next episode.